In this video, I'll show you how to add and use rulers and grids in Camtasia 2022. Welcome to this video. My name is David and I hope you're well wherever you are around the world. Now, in the latest version of Camtasia 2022 for Windows, it's possible to add rulers and grids. Pretty simple. And I'm just going to drag uh, some footage right here. And there we have a video of somebody just uh, walking on a road ATC. Now, Rulers and grid come into play, especially when you want to make sure that some content is lined up accurately. Now, people have made up their own rulers and grids that uh, they place them on top of the media to see what, what is happening. To add a ruler and grid, you can go to view, show canvas ruler, or you can also press on control shift R, click on that, and you'll see the ruler appear up here and on this side. Really, really awesome. So to use the rulers and uh, uh, the ruler available you'll need to click on either side there is the way to set up uh, the horizontal rulers you just click on this section and a ruler appears and then you drag it while still holding the left click and place it where you want it let's say you want it at 300 it's at 300 right about there looking good let's add another one at this zero mark click here scroll down uh, bring it down bring it down and then it's at zero the next one, let's say we, we take it to 300. That is negative 300. Here we go. There we go. Those are the three uh, lines for the horizontal. Now let's add some vertical lines so that we can create a grid. So you'll just click on this side and drag, let's say negative 600. That's what we want. Then click again, drag to zero. That's what we want. And then click and drag again to 600. Uh, and there we have it. We have our grid set up and I can actually just disable this track. And once I disable, that's what our grid looks like. Really, really good option. So we've added uh, the ruler. We've also made up our own grid uh, that we can use right here. Now, the next thing we need to do is maybe add some media that we probably wanted to make sure that it's at a particular position. So we can actually just go for maybe a call out and maybe add this particular rectangle. Let's say we wanted it up here. We don't need to guess at what position it's up there. It is being a setup because you can snap media to the grids available. Really, really handy tool. So you can just keep doing that. Maybe you wanted all these things somewhere right about there. Uh, you can just keep adding uh, to what you feel best. Uh, really depends on how you're feeling uh, with this thing. But uh, you can see that now you can have media snap to the grids and it looks really good especially when you don't want to keep on thinking and guessing where or what position should i have my media uh, to remove the rulers and grids pretty simple uh, you can just uh, let's assume you want to remove one you can just right click remove ruler guide and it's gone if you want to remove all of them just right click on one of them remove all ruler guides so once you remove, uh, you'll be able to see your media as it is. It's already positioned and so on and so forth. To remove the ruler, control shift R or click on view, hide canvas ruler, and it's gone. But simply put, that is how you can add and use uh, the Camtasia canvas ruler and grids in Camtasia 2022.3.0. I hope this tutorial is of value to you. Thank you so much for watching this video.